Hello everyone, I want to take a moment to explain to you how we can help reduce moisture in your residence hall room. Now, when it's in any residence hall room, there's one major thing to do if you have an air conditioning unit in the room. It is to keep the vents, the bottom intake vent, and the outtake vent clear. If you block either of these locations, the air conditioning system does not have the ability to intake the air, dehumidify it, and then re-put it into the air, which causes an excess of moisture in the room. So please make sure in any residence hall room that has AC in it to leave the intake vent open and the outtake vent open. Other things you can do to help prevent prevent moisture in the rooms. If you have a unit with a shared bathroom, such as in Neuer or Shively, and you have air conditioning units there, you want to make sure to keep the fan on and the door shut when you're taking a shower. There's moisture that happens when you take the shower and the vents help exhaust that from the room. So you want to keep that door closed so that moisture does not get into the room. If there is a high level of moisture in the room and there's no one using the restroom, you can open the door and turn on the fan and that can also help reduce that level of moisture in the room. A few other things you can do, keep the room tidy. With the more mess you have, the more likely it is that you could have moisture that is building from a wet towel or um, blocking a vent without even realizing it. Another thing you may want to do is if you have wet or damp clothes or towels, do not put them in a wardrobe and hang them up and hope they dry. You may want to grab some extra hooks, use the towel rods that are in here, but make sure that they're in an open space so the air can circulate and dry those spaces and items.